What a surprise. Another sequel to an old horror movie. Yay. Texas Chainsaw, as you can probably deduce, is a sequel to the original Texas Chainsaw Massacre, a horror movie from back in the day, and it is very much like the original. Leatherface uh, is finding his way to commit murders with chainsaws and other grotesque and awful things. It is a horror movie. That's what they do. I will say right off the bat, now I don't like this kind of movie uh, in general and I won't have a lot of great things to say about it, but right off the bat, I'm going to give credit where credit is due. This is a clever tie-in to the original. When I say that, what I mean is it finds an interesting and I think unique way to tie this movie into the original movie and I give it credit for that. That's about all I will give it credit for, but I will give it credit for that. After that, it becomes the same old type of horror movie. Lots of blood and guts, lots of death and dismemberment, lots of grotesque things. Of course, the typical very attractive young actors and actresses uh, finding themselves in a situation where they're killed off one by one, and one of them will eventually become the hero and help end this. Uh, and I should say, again, give it credit where credit is due in a little bit of a different and unique way. I'm not sure a good way, but different in unique way, at least in the case of this one. This is a horror movie in all regards, and it falls into all of those horror movie cliches once all is said and done. However, if you like those horror movie cliches, you may like Texas Chainsaw. As for me, and many like me, it's just one to skip.